What's up with it? It's your boy, man. It's the Mad Cleveland Browns fan. If you ain't know, you know now, man. We talking about straight Cleveland Browns action right now. Man, I just <clears throat> got done running my early morning errands, man. Just getting my day started. I woke up today about 4 a.m. And, and, and I just was ready, man. I don't know. Sometimes I don't know if you wake up ready sometimes. Like my man said, man, sometimes you just wake up dangerous. And today I woke up dangerous. But this video is about the raw receivers. Because I've just seen something go down. With my boys, um, Rashard Higgins, Juice, and Odell. Um, uh, and, 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 you know, I just kind of came across, you know, the Andrew Berry, the Stefanski, you know, clips. And for me personally, being a Mad Cleveland Browns fan, you know, I got to get my point of view on this stuff right now, man. You looking at Twitter, you checking out my boy Hollywood, man. You, uh, you, you check out his Twitter, man. You got to understand. Myself, I tell myself this as I talk to you, the dogs out here, you know, that's barking all across the globe. I'm just over here making sure that I stay focused and you stay focused, that people's Twitter is personal and business. Not everything that they post is about the profession of football. It's not. So for me, I had to sit back for a minute and I just looked at the article with my man, Greedy Williams. Shout out to Greedy. Um, good good news to hear about you, man, doing good on your recovery. And uh, Mary Kay, you're doing, a awesome, I'm doing an awesome job, Mary Kay Cabot. And um, Tony Grossi, all of you, all of you, y'all doing great. Trotter, Jake Trotter, y'all doing a great job. Um, so when I'm, I'm, I'm looking at Twitter, I'm looking at the videos, I'm on YouTube, I'm on ESPN, I'm all over the place, you feel me? I'm in a face with it, man. Like I say, I'm in crazy Sin City, Las Vegas, man, all the way from the great state of Ohio, man. Oh, wait, say it, I.O., man, don't play with me now. And you sit here and you like, man, what would you, like, your dream wide receiver tandem five years ago? Let's just say five years ago, you're sitting here and you're like, yo, me being a Cleveland Browns fan. And we're looking at the rest of the NFL five years down the road. You're like, dang. We got Odell Beckham, Higgins, and Juice Landry as our three wide receivers. Would you have ever imagined that five years ago? Huh? Would you ever imagine that five years ago? No, I mean, no, no, you're, not, you're talking about right now because you have them on your team. But this is the offseason. And just sitting here, you're looking at these videos and everybody trying to break up our team. And there's some of these people out here that are supposed to be Cleveland Brown fans. They're supposed to be dogs. And it's looking like y'all trying to break up this dang on pretty trio that we got going on right now. You got two best friends, man, playing on the same team. How many times have you seen that happen in the NFL, man, when you got two of the greatest NFL wide receivers to ever touch the football? Respectively, when Juice was in Miami, he was the number one wide receiver in the Miami Dolphins uniform. When Odell Beckham was in the New York Giants uniform, he was respectively the number one wide receiver in New York. And when Higgins Hollywood touches the NFL field from Cleveland, the team that, uh, that, 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 that drafted him when he came out of Colorado, <clears throat> came out of Colorado State, if I'm not mistaken, Hollywood came out here laying a red carpet ever since he got a chance to stay on the field. And now when you're sitting here, you're looking at, are you looking at my man's shaking bake a uh, Baker Mayfield? And you're like, yo, rewind five years back. You like, dang man, I'm playing Madden at the house. And next all of a sudden, you like, man, let me make a team for the Cleveland Browns for five years down the road. Just say just for craps and giggles that I got Odell, Juice, and Higgins on my team as my as my as my triplets, as my wide receivers. Who would have ever thought that, man? And now we got people out here wanting to break this up, man. Listen, listen, man. I know the haters out there, they don't want to see a shine. And some of these Cleveland Browns people who I be seeing talking about break this up. Like we won something. Huh? Like we won something. You hear me? 
We haven't won nothing yet. You got two best friends playing, man. That he hasn't even seen their ceiling yet with this. Well, this is our first year. Going into our second year with this coach, with Kevin Stefanski, this would be our second year with Andrew Barry being at the helm, man. Listen, man. Listen, man. We are ripe and ready right now, right now for prime time to take over the NFL if you just keep the nucleus that you have. You have every wide receiver, when you're looking at them, talk about their numbers. And you're talking, you see these, these grown men talking about how they contribute to the NFL at the highest of levels. When they were the primary wide receivers, when they was getting double team and everything, they was setting the league on fire. It don't matter who's on Landry, man. He's making the catch, man. You hear me? Higgins, man. Look at how many drop passes he got, man. How many times people got to put respect on these man's name, man. Now, we, y'all know how I am about Odell, man. Come on now, pimp. Player to player, pimp to pimp. Lobster and throw. Odell Beckham, man. If y'all really want to get rid of Odell Beckham, man, please, man. Just, just say you don't want Cleveland Browns to win, man. Just say you don't want us to win, man. Shoot, man, it don't make no sense, man. I ain't never seen this hater rizzle, man, come before. Somebody, man, it's Tom Brady right now. Like, yo, hey, yo, Bruce Arians. I like our team. I like what we got. We just got the Super Bowl last year and everything was sweet, man. But if I can have Odell, Juice, and Higgins, I'd rather keep what I got. Seriously, you think Tom Brady going to say that? You think Tom Brady would rather have the wide receivers he got in Tampa Bay instead of our wide receivers in a Cleveland Brown uniform, the Brown North? Huh? You got to be kidding me, man. And you wonder why I'm the mad Cleveland Browns fan, man. But right now, I'm not about to, I'm not about to get all loud. All right, it's not even necessary. I'm looking at Andrew Barry. I'm looking at Kevin Stefanski, and I'm seeing them talking in their video, their, their video view, their interviews, their mandatory interviews. They're saying what they have to say, man, with the with the league protocol, man. You hear me? They want to keep all three wide receivers. You got a young Donovan Peoples. You hear me? You got every one of these wide receivers want to stay in Cleveland and win a Super Bowl in the Cleveland Browns uniform. Something that has never happened ever. They want to be here. The coach wants to win a Super Bowl. He doesn't want to start over again. You have a system in place and these men know the system. So why would you want to break up the system? Makes sense of this. So when y'all sit here and y'all continue to look at all this stuff with all the boo blob that they're going to be talking about with our Browns, y'all remember that the mad Cleveland Browns fan told y'all what the real is, what the deal is for real is, man. You keep the core, I say no more. It's your boy, man, the Mad Clear Browns fan, man. I'm glad y'all came and tuned into the page right now. I got to go and rip and run, man. My girl just hop back in the car, man. You know how the game go, man. <laughs> man, I got to do what I got to do, man. This is it, man. It's sunny Las Vegas, man, all the way from beautiful Las I mean, from all the way from beautiful Las Vegas. Shout out here from Ohio, man, the Mad Clear Browns fan. I'm putting on for the city, man. Y'all know I'm repping brown and orange everywhere I go. I got the Cleveland Cavs hat in the back, man, and I got the Ohio State all over the car, man. I ain't playing with you, man. I'm staying with you, man. Listen, man, I'm going to do what I do, man. Man, I'm going to let y'all know, man, where's the best bars and the best sports places in the casinos to go to to watch the Browns, man. That, you know, I'm, I'm rocking, man. I'm rocking, man. You hear me? So make sure y'all go and subscribe, man. Y'all like, y'all share, man. Y'all talk mess, man. Y'all keep leaving them comments, man. Y'all, I'm reading them comments, man. I'm coming for you haters, man. I'm coming for you Cleveland Brown haters, man. I don't care if you got any other color on, man. If it ain't brown and orange, man. Let's go, dogs, bro.